Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, fellow acolytes and Factorio interested people. We are back with another episode and last time... By the way, I lost my car again. <laughs> there it is. Last time we were bringing together the four ingredients that we need for the science packs level 3. Uh, which are made, I guess, in simple assembling machines version 2, hopefully. <laughs> and today uh, we want to bring them together and start researching stuff. Of course I'll research uh, most of the stuff off screen again, but um, the things we need to progress I'll research. Uh, in this episode and of course uh, I want to fix my base a little bit a little bit more so we've got another problem we are not getting tinned copper wire anymore and this is because our tin tin is made but our copper is not made Right, because our copper mine is almost empty, so let's fix that first. Hey, there's some oil flowing around. Okay, see there's our copper mine. And I guess I have to get rid of some trees. Uh, but I still got... Oh, wait. Let, let me first pick up my mining drills. Okay, and then let's see. I still got grenades, so. <laughs> okay. I guess this copper field is almost empty. Let's see, copper ore here. Mm, yes, it's 50% empty. Okay. Mining drill mark two. Only two of them? No. Actually seven. What? Nine? Hmm. Something's wrong. Okay, so let's see here. One. Two. Three. One. Two. Three. Okay, do we still have... Ah, uh, I forgot. I forgot to bring transportation belts. <laughs> Screwing only one bolt in. Okay, so let me... Oh, I still got tin copper wire. So, uh, while getting me the transportation belts, let me just get these tinned copper wires in here. Just so that production can move on. Okay. And then let's take some some transportation belts which are back here two stacks should be enough okay because I can't sleep well at night <laughs> with no copper production going on and that's why I have to fix this because we do uh, before we do anything else okay so this is that right so our old transportation belt still works practically 
and this is that and I think this should balance itself no need for a splitter here now we just need electrical power as always Okay, so we are mining copper ore, 70, oh, 642 pieces per minute. So in three hours of playtime this copper ore field will be gone and then we have to look for another one. Okay, so now let me get ready some assembly machines. What am I missing? Iron, as always. Give me the iron. Okay. Let's see. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Energy consumption is higher. Crafting speed is higher. Hmm. Eight. Eight of them. I don't know if I can feed eight of them. <laughs> uh, let's start with assembly machine ones. Okay. And I wanted to put them directly here, I think. Because our bus is here in the middle. <clears throat> okay, and it will be a two belt configuration. So let's see. Oh, right, you can't make cyan packs that way. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right, because this assembly machine can. Ingred um, stuff, craft stuff that uses up four ingredients. Okay, so we can't use the standard standard stuff. Mm, okay, we have to move one tile lower, I guess. Yes. Okay, not a problem. One, two, three, four. Let's get power right away. <laughs> like so. Just wasting my power poles here, but who cares? So again, science pack three. And you'll need batteries, motor, bronze plates. So let's see, how can we do this? One of the belts obviously has to be a little bit longer, I guess. So let's have bronze plates coming from there and our electrical engine units from here okay so where are the bronze plates made they are here okay that's actually not too far away okay so underground belts we need some Come on! So like so, and then like so, and like so, and like so. Oops, wrong direction. Okay, bronze plates coming in.
Mm, I guess I can put a third machine here. As you can see. Okay, more power. And make this a little bit longer. Okay. Since uh, engines are apparently difficult to put together and only need three iron gear wheels, I think three of these machines are fine. Okay, and now you guys. We need four long handed inserters. Mm. Alright. I wonder how long does it take to craft a science pack 3? 12 seconds. Engine unit, 10 seconds. Okay, so they take a while to craft. Anyway, so that's good. Uh, now I have to fiddle a little bit. And I still need transport belts. Okay, so we have to combine the electrical plates uh, as soon as we make them together with the batteries, which actually makes sense in a way because both of them come from the top side of the base. There they are. So this is the main bus. Why is that not even... Hmm. Guess I'll put a splitter here. And I saw there's something wrong. Which I'll have to fix here. Oh no, there's nothing wrong. These come in pretty slow. Why is that? Ah, because we don't have enough copper. We are getting copper. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> we are producing copper like nothing else. But at the moment we still have a high need for copper. Because all of our base practically lives and dies with copper. Okay, but it should soon stack up and we should be fine. Okay. All right. Okay, now let's see. We need a splitter. We need two splitters. <laughs> we need one to go away from the bus. And then... We need the batteries. So this will be an underground belt. For the moment at least. And this is where the batteries come into the bus. Okay. And then we split off the batteries. Let's take a moment here. This is this is the same height of this belt. So this has to be an underground belt. 
and one, two. This is the original bus for batteries. Okay. So Oops, I meant to click this one, so we have to split it, let's see here, we have to come down here, okay, so let's split that off here, and this will come onto that belt, and this will come onto that belt. Right now they are joined. Keeping in mind that this is the bus. Okay, and this is the actual battery bus, so to keep things in order, I'm gonna use underground belts. Alright, like so, okay, and then I'll just need to bring them down and get more more transportation belts. They are getting used up pretty quickly. To my experience. Okay. Coming down here. Ah, since the belt is already combined, I can just make a U-turn here. Alright, and everyone is picking stuff that they need, right? And this will be the output belt. And we are producing science packs. Two of them even. Okay, so that's good. Uh, let's tidy up stuff here. So this is battery bus, okay, doesn't matter. This is the copper plate bus. Uh, so this has to be like that okay and I don't think we need iron plates anymore but this here is the steel bus right steel bus so this has to go okay Very good. Okay, so I think I'll wrap it up here and just connect these to my lab area off screen. And I'll show off <laughs> how that looks in the next episode. And I'll also uh, research all the stuff a little bit off screen. So, yeah. Uh, wait. <laughs> Let me check first the, on the timer. Ah, okay. Uh, I see we still have some time left apparently. So then I can show to you. Still got 10 minutes. Dude, we work fast. Okay, let's just go below here. And then uh, it's the ammunition factory. Let's just keep it tight. Okay, this should be fine.
Okay, and then we come through the tin factory. But it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, let's get rid of these trees. Okay. Uh, hello? Right. Need another underground build. I don't want to hurt nature, but sometimes it leaves me with no choice. Okay, and then I guess I'll need some advanced underground stuff. So let's get these. And then I'll need a ton, a button of gear wheels. And I bet this will screw with my with my whole <laughs> gear wheel production. Okay. Hmm. I guess I'll also start producing these belts here in this factory and that one's belt so I can make more of the underground belts faster. Okay, you go in here. Nice. Okay, you... Come up here. Go down here. <laughs> and just one more underground belt. Uh, damn it. <laughs> Uh, this has to start here and come up here. This has to go. Oh. And we still need power here. Okay. Now this goes in here. And then we just need to connect this one all right and then we can make the inner circle so let's see this will be this will be the inner circle mm. and I want these to come up from this side and the other science packs I guess level 4 I don't know how much levels there are uh, apparently 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 <laughs> okay okay but the other science packs I plan to put in somewhere here or at least any other side okay so I guess I sadly have to get rid of some of these trees from our nicely park area for our scientists okay 
Uh, something's not messes. Not right. Ah, uh, yes. We are missing something. We are missing you. Okay, I see the science packs coming in. There they are. Okay. Ah, oh, we're missing a belt. Here they come. So, let's start. Mm. What would be nice? Insert a stack capacity bonus. Let's start researching that. And of course we need inserters. <laughs> okay. So basically, as you can see, um, since there are eight different science packs, we need two outer rings, so a red and the normal inserters on this side, and two inner rings, so a red and the normal inserters on the inside. Okay. Hmm. So let me get some more inserters and then I think it's wrapping up point. Science is moving a bit slow somehow, but we are only doing science with four. four labs so let's see how it goes if we stock it up to eight and as you can see our uh, transport belt inner ring for the science packs level three is already full to the brim so i think we are doing good on producing them okay Let's get power in here. So basically, I was just a little bit uh, untidy while setting this power up. Okay. So I'll see if I can get rid of stuff. I should be able to. Okay, this is necessary, this is all necessary. <laughs> um, okay, now we are missing a connection to the center. Alright. And now we are missing a connection here. Okay. And now we are back at full capacity. Full science speed. And then later on we will do a speed module. Okay, nice. So I think I'll wrap it up here for this episode. <laughs> no, really. Uh, and I will keep researching stuff off screen. And next episode, we can start making more advanced stuff like mining productivity 427. So I guess I can research that four times. Hopefully, <laughs> we'll see. Uh, at least we got more productivity. And perhaps we can also get more and better energy and have a better uh, prevention of pollution. Hopefully, because now that we're back smelting stuff with 5000 parts per million pollution, uh, we will most likely have to get rid of these aliens and then we'll see. Alright, so anyways, I thank you all for watching. I hope you had fun up until here. Perhaps you will even learn something new about Factorio. Uh, if you liked this episode, like it, share it, write a nice comment or not so nice comment if you want to. Yeah, and if you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel, 
uh, it's much needed and highly appreciated support. And again, thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye bye.